Hello, this is BVI Channel 1. My name is Queen Madu, and you're welcome to another segment of Reason with Queen. So, I saw this very funny clip, but before I say anything, I want you guys to watch. Me, for instance, they say men are the head of the family. I don't want to be the head of the family. In my family, I'm not the head. <laughs> you get it? Because I don't know, I don't see why I'm married. And because I'm married, immediately I'm married, I'm the head. Just because I'm married, I'm the head. Just because I'm a man and married to somebody else, I'm, I'm the head. Whether she's intelligent than me, whether she's uh, kind of saying stronger than me, whether she's, she can think on her feet more than I do, whether she can fight more than... Because I'm a man, I'm a, no, I don't, I don't say... To be the head of the family, I don't like it. To be the head of the family, I don't like it. Because when they were making that, they didn't consult me. <laughs> you, so you can't come and just push it on me. You understand? <laughs> so if I don't like it this way, then it means to say the fact that I have to also provide for a woman, I don't like it. That I bring a woman home and then I'm coming to provide for you. Mm. For instance, the woman I married, we all sat in the same class. She's my classmate. We all sat in the same <laughs> class. We were taught the same lessons. <laughs> you understand? We graduated the same day. We left to go and look for a job. And we had jobs and now we are we are we are we are together. You understand? And now it's my money that I have to use to take care of you. What is what is your money? What is happening to your money? And he said, I can't ask this question. You've seen the video, right? Okay. This is the most hilarious thing I've ever heard in a while. I've never seen a man so, you know, <laughs> carrying his ego and dropping it on the ground. Boom. I don't want to do. I'm not interested. I don't want to be the head. In this particular video, I really want you guys to tell me your opinion, especially the men. Tell me exactly what you think about the video, you get? Because I found out that a lot of men want to eat their cake and have it. And it is really unfortunate because you want your woman to be submissive. You want your woman to take care of the home, take care of the children. And you still want that same woman to provide. Kai! When I get conscious at all, do you people even pity women at all? So when is she getting the relief that she's married to you? And the truth is, when you have those children, they are the fastest to tell you that they are the they are, he, he, his children, like they answer his name and everything. So why exactly is she married to you? You understand? See, in as much as I believe in partnership in marriage, I don't believe in this head or tail or man or woman or whatever. I believe in partnership in marriage, seriously, a lot. I believe that I should help my husband to harness his finances, help him out the best way I can to make life easy for him on that aspect. And I also believe that my husband should help me in the home and with the children to make life easy for me in that aspect. That is how I see marriage. That is how I see life. And I think when you help your husband financially and your husband help you at the house, it makes it easier for the both of you. I am not saying it should be 50-50, you understand? You can come to the aid of your partner for example if your husband has a business he he runs you can go there and help instead of maybe sitting at the house if you don't have a job but if you have a job you can pick up one or two expenses in the house without even letting him know like pay the water bill pay the light bill help with the children's uh, uh, this thing whatever maybe clothes or like you can go to the market see something you get it makes them happy it means they're happy that they are relieved. Sometimes you can even make his favorite meal with your money. And he comes back and he'll be like, oh my God, I've done that a lot for my husband. Like, he does come back and I know this is his favorite meal. I'll withdraw money. I'll go and make it. I don't, you don't have to wait. You don't have to wait for him to get you everything. He relieves them. The burden are taken off from their shoulder if you can afford to make your hair yourself you can't just make it if you can afford to subscribe your phone if you leave everything for somebody it weighs them down and it crumbles them it's the same thing in the house as a man maybe weekend periods like this you know that ah, this woman is trying to she used to come to my shop oh, she used to do this so oh, she used to do that though you can help with the dishes, the clothes, the house, you know, tidy up, help with the children. 
it relieves the woman that is why you see some couples are happy they are shining they are they are glowing because they understand what real marriage is all about it's all about partnership it's all about making the life of your partner easy so this particular person now i will only have a problem with him if he still wants a submissive woman a woman that we cook a woman that we clean a woman that we uh, uh, look after him and a woman that as what are you the prize like you are just the only man on earth that if she does not marry you like this eh, her life is has, has scattered her life has budget that you will not come someone's child to a slave that is why we have a problem with this man who, this kind of person now if he, he says he doesn't want to provide like he claim he doesn't want to be the head of the family because like i said this is the first time i'm actually seeing a man say this since you don't want to be the head of the family, fine. You will do the work of a woman, though. You will take care of the kids. You will take care of the home. And when you do it two times or three times, it's not the one that you want You, you want the woman to provide for you. And you still want to sit on the uh, couch and cross your leg to be served. And to be doing, and you'll be doing all that. On top of what? A whole princess like you. That you cannot take up your responsibility, you are trying to run away. Like he said, that he does not like the idea of providing for a woman. You see, you, you, you can imagine that mentality. If you don't have, like the idea of providing for a woman, what exactly is your act of service to your family? Because even the Bible says that a man that does not provide for his family is worse than an infidel. So, what exactly is making you a man? Like he said, he doesn't want to be a man. Fine. Then you choose one gender. You will do other things. You cannot be useless in the house. So I want you guys, this is my opinion though, about this video. So I want you guys to tell me exactly your own opinion in this video. Because this video is really, really funny and hila hila hilarious. I'm sorry the way I speak. I have um, a flu, you know, cold, so I cough. So pardon.